When it comes to retreading tires, everyone has an opinion. My biggest concern, safety. I just don't trust the retreads. Because you know that's not a brand new tire. Retreads are the ones that disintegrate from the heat and wear and tear. Uh, when I spend my money on my trucks, my fleet, I buy Virgin tires. I don't know what retreading tires has to do with the environment. Yes, people are talking about retreading tires. You can even hear about it on the news. Approaches. Now we have a growing backup on 465, folks. Looks like another retread is blown, and there's rubber blocking the left and center lanes. But what are the facts about retreading tires? Why is retreading, and in many cases repairing worn or damaged tires, actually the smarter tire solution? Let's find out. The tire retreading industry is almost as old as the tire industry itself, dating back to the early 1900s. Roads back then were unpaved and full of hazards. Most tires only averaged about a thousand miles before wearing out. People began working on ways to extend tire service life right from the very start. Today, there are approximately 750 retread plants throughout North America, from small operations to huge facilities. Millions of tires are retreaded each year. Before a tire can be retreaded, it must pass multiple rigorous inspection procedures. Only those tires that meet industry standards will proceed through the retreading process. The old tread is removed with a special type of buffer which exposes the casing or foundation of the tire. Then, in a process very similar to the manufacture of a new tire, a new rubber tread is bonded to the casing. Once the new tread is applied to the casing, it is nearly impossible to tell the difference between a retread tire and a new tire. My biggest concern? Safety. I just don't trust the retreads. So, what are the facts? Are retreads safe? Absolutely. Retreaded tires perform just as well as regular tires and can be driven at the same speed and deliver similar mileage. Retreads are used safely every day on school buses, fire engines and ambulances, trucking fleets, taxis, government and military vehicles. Every commercial airline, as well as many military aircraft, take off and land every day on retreaded tires. Today in North America, there are as many retreaded tires in operation as there are original Tread Life tires. Because you know that's not a brand new tire. Retreads are the ones that disintegrate from the heat and wear and tear. One of the more common myths surrounding retreaded tires is that they're the primary cause of rubber debris littering our roadways. Several industry studies have revealed that the primary causes of tire debris on the road is tire overheating due to underinflation or overloading. This is regardless of whether the tire is a new tire or a retread. For more detailed information on this topic, you can view our Rubber on the Road video. Uh, when I spend my money on my trucks, my fleet, I buy Virgin tires. Everyone is looking to save a buck, especially in today's economy. The bottom line is, retreading saves money. A retreaded tire costs less to produce than a new tire and sells for less, usually between 30 and 50 percent less. That's a big savings for the end user. By using retreaded tires, commercial trucking fleets, airlines, and state and local governments save millions of dollars per year. I don't know what retreading tires has to do with the environment. The answer is plenty, because the real concern for all of us right now is not just saving money, but saving our planet. Everyone is talking green, and that is where retreading tires takes on a major role. Consider this. It's estimated that nearly 300 million tires from cars and trucks are thrown away by Americans each year. Discarded tires are either taking up space in our landfills, being thrown illegally on the side of the road or onto private property, or are becoming breeding grounds for mosquitoes and rodents, many of these carrying diseases. 
Many people try to burn tires. These fires can last for months, releasing toxic chemicals into the air that can also run off into our water sources. It's not a pretty picture. The key, of course, is tire recycling. 30 years ago, only a small percentage of tires were recycled. Today, that number has risen dramatically, with 89% of all tires being recycled in some way. Recycled tires are being used as fuel and an ever-growing number of products that benefit homes, businesses, and schools, including mulch and as rubberized asphalt used on playgrounds and on athletic fields. Another way to keep tires out of landfills is by repairing worn or damaged tires. Only specially trained personnel using the proper tools and procedures should repair tires. But the one tire recycling solution that has the greatest positive impact on the environment and economy is through retreading. Not only is retreading saving millions of scrap tires from disposal each year, but almost 100% of the waste from the process can be reused to create useful products. Instead of ending up in landfills, used tires that have been retreaded can continue their useful lives for thousands of more miles. Retreading tires is beneficial to the environment in other ways, too. Medium truck tires require approximately 22 gallons of oil to process. It takes only 7 gallons to retread. Retreads save hundreds of millions of gallons of oil each year, as well as other raw materials, such as natural rubber, steel, and carbon black. Retreading tires also has the potential to make a substantial contribution to reducing carbon emissions. The retreading process generates over 70% less emissions than production of a new tire. What's in store for the future? For starters, studies are underway exploring the potential of using recycled rubber to create new rubber for tire production, as well as tread for retreads. Another important development designed to increase fuel efficiency is the low rolling resistance retreaded commercial truck tire. Many retreading plants are stepping up their own green initiatives for tomorrow by developing aggressive recycling policies and utilizing new technology. This state-of-the-art plant is actually using solar power to buff, build and cure tires. We've come a long way since the early days of retreading. Retreads have been proven reliable, safe and cost-effective. Most importantly, Retreads have been proven a driving force on the road to a greener planet. For more information about the economic and environmental benefits of tire retreading and tire repairing, visit the Tire Retread and Repair Information Bureau at www.retread.org.